city this is my lovely outfit of the morning i had a nice morning planning out the week the podcast lots of things this is a really um exciting week especially for gals on the go and i'm doing something fun later today um but first i just want to go for a little morning walk i'm really trying to get moving more in the morning because i think it just kind of helps just flow my energy my emotions everything i don't know i just think it's a really good way to start the day and I haven't been doing it because it's been so cold, but we're braving it. We had a snowstorm this weekend. It was awesome, but um, now there's like all this, I think it's called sludge. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about, but um, yeah, we're going to go for a little walk, maybe get coffee or maybe a juice, something that'll be my reward for this walk, but really just want to walk. So I'm going to pop the AirPods in and let's ride, baby. Okay guys, I'm about to head out the door, um, but we are headed to do a little tourist action. I'm going to the Edge NYC. It's this um, tall building with like an edge to it and you get to look out into the city. Um, I'll have more info when I get there probably, but I'm actually doing a really fun campaign with Sunglass Hut and it might be up by the time this vlog is up. And I get to go up there. They gave me a few tickets to bring up a friend and someone to help us take some pics and enjoy the views of the edge while wearing our sunglass hut. Look how, like, are these not me? Like, the green. So I'm wearing these from Versace. And then I'm bringing my friend Kelly, my new bestie. <laughs> um, she's coming with as well. And I have a pair of purple sunglasses for her. I'm so thankful that she was willing to come and have some fun. And then Caroline, who does a lot of stuff for Gals on the Go, she helps Brooke and I sometimes as well. She's coming to help take some pics. And don't you guys worry, I was going to bring Brooke, but she literally was just at the edge and we talked about it and she's fine with me going without her. So it's okay. <laughs> I know I'm gonna get messages. So I just did my hair at the Dyson Airwrap. I've been using it a lot more again. Do love it. Green long sleeve is from Revolve. These are Aritzia um, faux leather pants. This jacket is from Princess Polly. Wearing some combat boots and then obviously the sunglasses. And then I'm loving this bag I just got from New New N U N O O. Such a cute tote because straight from the edge we are going to the gals on the go office because it's monday which means we're recording the podcast so i think i'm gonna have some time in between but i just figured since i'll be like on the west side might as well just go to soho not come back over to lower east you know so yeah this is the fit let's get on with the day i am so excited i've been wanting to go to the edge this will be great here we go <laughs> we're on a ride we're at disney world yep kelly's here Caroline's here. Everybody's here. <laughs> Where are we right now? Oh my god. I'm nervous. <laughs> I know. I feel like I'm at Epcot. Oh my god. You look so glam. <laughs> We're holding hands. I can't. I can't. Oh my god. I don't know, fam. That is tough. Wow. Ooh, I didn't know that was a feature of this building. <laughs> We just left the edge and now we're approaching Jack's coffee. I've seen people post about it. <laughs> and there's Kelly. Why are we and we're gonna we're gonna try this place out. Hey guys, we've transported to the Gals in the Go office. 
Got some soup from the Balcazar Cafe. I've never tried this one before, but it comes with bread and butter, which I was really hyped about. Does this not look amazing? They topped the rice off with some, or they topped the soup off with some rice. It's Moroccan chicken soup, and then you get bread and butter, which I love. I got here a little bit early before Brooke's here so I could eat and just get a couple things done, and then you know the drill for Mondays. Just touched up my makeup a little bit. Back with Brooke. Hello. She walked in and I was like, I feel like I haven't seen you in I know, so that's long. long. It's time. It was like We've gone over a week. Or I guess just a week because it was yeah, last yeah. Monday. And we're watching Bachelor together tonight. I know, we're excited. I literally was like, Brooke, I'm inviting myself over. I want to watch The Bachelor with you. She was like, I'll be tweeting, live I tweeting. Know. So hopefully. That's why I usually try not to do like girls' night, Bachelor, because I like sit there. I'm like, you know, I like, just like want to have your post notifications <laughs> on and sit there and just like, I just, we're both movie talkers, so I'm really excited to watch with you. Yeah, no, we'll be good. It'll be so fun. So we're about to record an episode. It's golden hour right now. Yes. It's amazing out. I feel like we should take a selfie right now. Yeah, let's the do it. The lighting's really nice. <laughs> Hey. Yeah. Ginger Guys, she just took a ginger shot, made a TikTok, and chased with baby carrots. So Icon good. only. So Icon. Quiet on the set, please. Gals in the go, starting. I feel like we're about to record like iCarly. Like, oh my god. Five, five four, four three, three, two. two. Boom, 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 boom. Love it. All right, see you guys later. Just got back, lit my candles immediately, put on my barefoot dreams robe. I got some packages in the mail well by packages i mean this right here my sun basket for the week not sponsored i got inspired by katie Pilotti. these meals are so good they're fresh and ready so this is gonna be my dinner tonight um hmm i really liked the turkey chili last time what is this korean beef i can't remember so i'm gonna make one of these for dinner right now just uploading the episode that we did today it was really good we talked about how to live your best life i need to do my dishes now that it's so sludgy outside i like have to leave my shoes all right here because i don't want to leave them right outside my door and like be annoying to everybody so i don't know what i need i guess i like don't know what to do about this but just this corner is looking a little chaotic for me i went with the korean beef and this smells divine i'm so excited that was so easy wow Oh my gosh, the Korean beef was so good. I want to figure out if I can recreate that or I'll just get that again next week, I guess. Um, I just got this in the mail. I finally got my Georgia National Championship shirt. Dogs on top, baby. Also got a coffee mug. I'm really excited about that. Just opened up Health Aid Kombucha. This one's blood orange, carrot, and ginger. But um, it doesn't taste like carrot. I was a little worried about that. But um, yeah, so... I have a lot of dishes from cooking yesterday. So that's what we're gonna do. I wanted to make ginger shots today too, but that might be a, oh, tomorrow's really busy. Maybe I'll do that later tonight, I don't really know. But um, I'm gonna get some dishes done, clean up a little bit, and then I'm gonna go over to Brooke's house, Brooke's house, Brooke's apartment, and watch Bachelor. I just remember this moment of kind of coming here for a second to just like shave. Forget. So um, one thing that we talk about. Yay, we are all clean here. Okay, so I'm about to go to Brooke's apartment, and I really feel, I just cleaned the counter, so we're good. I really feel like doing some gua sha and just face rolling, so I'm bringing some oil and this to her apartment, so while we watch, I can roll. I think this is pretty um, efficient of me. I'm also considering stopping by Dwayne Reed and getting snacks. I just am so excited for a little bachelor watching night. I've been watching alone. I'm about to head over to Brooks, <laughs> wearing my Georgia shirt, and then Gals on the Go merch, baby. And then sweatpants, Aritzia, fake Uggs from Amazon. They're linked on my Amazon shop, which is always down below. I'm gonna throw over a puffer, and then we're gonna, we're gonna go over there. I'm gonna get some snacks. I really want Cheez-Its, so. I'm a mess today. I'm in a weird mood today. Can you guys tell? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm in a weird mood. Well, this sucks. They don't have the original ones. Ugh, should I just get goldfish? That'll do. Made it to the Hizau. Oh, welcome. About to watch the live tweeter in her oh, habitat. Tweeting. Do you just like think of things and then tweet it? Yes, yes. I'll be like, ooh. Ooh, like. like I don't know, just, it just flows. It's like creativity, you know? It's yeah. Just, it's I'm, tonight at 11. Tonight at 11. I'm really yeah, excited. Sure. Got. My facial tools, goldfish. Brooks got hers here oh, as well. Yes, we've got here we go. <laughs> got a whole situation over shift. here. <laughs> <laughs> the closing shift. 
She she's like, do you want some hot chocolate? I look over. She's like over the pot. Like, <laughs> oh my god, mushroom or mushroom? Mu- mushroom. <laughs> mushrooms, bro. And whipped cream. That's for my so. Gel. That's so. Wow, I love Batch Mondays. Oh, yeah, I'm like, I'm oh sorry, I'm like. So, oh no, you're good. I'm in. I'm in uh, mom mode. <laughs> you do. You give me mom vibes right now. Like the bun with the. Do you want some Ovaltine? <laughs> I would like some oval teen. Oh no, it's spilling everywhere. No, nowhere. Maybe get your phone away. Okay. Oh, it's just spilling. <laughs> it's so hard to pour it out of the pot. That's the I know you. Guys, look at this magic Brooke just prepared. Cheers. I'm gonna take, it's gonna be really hot, just so we're clear. Well, the whipped, cream, <laughs> the whipped cream, the whipped cream kind of yeah, like yeah, buffers yeah. it. Wow, beautiful. Yeah, I don't I work here. <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Just loaded up. Just got off an hour long FaceTime with Delaney. It was kind of random, but it was fun to just chat. How did you get back for breakfast? Well, I guess I didn't just get back at this point, but you guys get the idea. I did it. I finally got the Skinny Confidential Ice Roller. So many of you told me that if I liked my Amazon one, I would really like this. I still really like the Amazon one. Cause sometimes I don't like when it gets too cold and apparently this holds cold really well, which is awesome. But I don't like when it like stings your face. So we'll see. But this, I mean, it says hot mess on this side. This just feels so good. It's like this amazing material. It has a place for your thumb. I mean, I had to pre-order it and it just came, but I'm gonna put this in the freezer and I'll show you guys in the morning how how it does, but I'm excited to use this. And then I am obsessed with skims. I think I place a skims order like every few weeks. Um, I just bought more of these Fits Everybody tees. I love them. I just got another black and another tan because you just can't have too many and they just, they're great layering pieces. They just look so good. They're so flattering. And then skims just came out with the outdoor collection. And I don't have a lot of zip ups and sometimes I find, I don't know, like I don't want to mess up my hair all the time. I don't know. I just wanted more zip ups in my life. And sometimes I want to like take my jacket on and off, but I don't want to have to pull it over my hair. So I found this and sometimes when I get spray tans, I need like a dark outfit that I can put on. But like if I'm still running errands and stuff, if I have something on, I don't know. That's my thought process behind this. So I got... This is from their outdoor collection. I got this zip up jacket. I got it in a size medium. It's like semi cropped. It's not fully black. I think it was called the color suit, S O O T. Um, so I'd say it's kind of like a grayish charcoal situation. And then I got the matching sweatpants in a size medium. So hopefully these fit. I'm sure I'll wear this this week because I'm getting a spray tan on Thursday. So maybe we'll try it out. And I just want to have it for life. I feel like it'd be good for traveling too. And then I, I'm gonna put this on my Instagram story tomorrow because I'm freaking out. Delta Airlines, my favorite airlines ever, sent me a PR package. Like, what? They basically um, sent two of these like canned wines. And then what their um, new little packet is, if you ride first class with them, or I guess it's Delta One, um, when they give you all the little amenities, they are showing you what that's gonna look like this year. Um, so I'm very honored. I'm totally gonna post a story of them. Like, I mean, Delta Airlines, is, I mean, the amount of money I spent on Delta Airlines, which I'm not complaining, but so that was pretty cool. Big day tomorrow, you guys. I feel like I did not vlog enough today. I'm feeling so much better. I was feeling so funky and then going to Brooks. We literally just laughed and rolled our faces together and then FaceTiming Delaney after too. It's so crazy like how you can get in your own head and just like be having such a crappy day. I don't know. And like when I was with Kelly earlier, she's like, what's going on? Like you're not yourself. And I literally have known her for like three weeks. And I was like, wow, like you can tell. But, and then like after she noticed that I was just like, yeah, I'm just feeling this way, whatever. It was just so nice to kind of release that a little bit. And then uh, Delaney kind of brought it up I was like, yeah, I just kind of feel like a clouds over my head this week or something. Like, I just don't feel like 100% myself. I feel good. I feel great. But I just don't feel 100% myself. And even just saying those words out loud and talking to her, it's so crazy how much it helps. Like I feel like a load's been lifted off of me because I feel like a lot of like anxiousness is having that feeling on your chest. Like it's just so heavy. Like I couldn't feel like I could just relax. But right now, 
feel like I could lean back and watch TV and feel relaxed. So I know I've been talking a lot about my anxiety recently, but I've just been hiding it for a while and not wanting to talk about it. And I just, I don't know, talking about it has been very therapeutic for me and it immediately helps. Um, it doesn't cure it but it definitely helps and just seeing all of your comments talking about it and making me feel like I'm not alone. I really, really appreciate it and I hope that you guys feel the same way by me talking about this in my videos. I don't wanna just push through and be like, today's a great day, hee hee, latte, love. Like, some days I wake up and I just don't feel myself and that was today. There wasn't like a big reason. I just didn't feel myself and I think that's okay to say. So, anyways, I'm feeling a lot better now. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm gonna clean up like I freaking always do. The only thing about my apartment, I feel like I constantly have to clean it because I'm trying to go for this minimalistic look. So I like need to, I don't know. I'm rambling now. I need to go to bed. The sleepy time tea is hitting. Big day tomorrow, we got hair. I have like a two hour call with my management team. And then after that, we're doing a Gals on the Go merch shoot. <laughs> I am so excited. And we're doing like hair, makeup, the whole thing. Well, I'm getting my hair done in the morning. So I'm just getting my makeup done by Kat. So. Very excited, get hyped. Tomorrow's gonna be a good day, but I need to rest up for it. So I'm gonna get in bed, read my book. I'm still reading November 9th by Colleen Hoover. I'm almost done with it. Oh. Good night, guys. Look at who's here. She's so fabulous. She strolls in bearing gifts. I'm so honored. Well, you gave me a gift too, but. I gave her some sneakers. These are so cute, guys. This is a candle. You got this for me because it's yellow? Yes, your favorite color. I love, we know each other. What's it called? Mm -hmm. Carrot, iris, and amber. Amber. Carrot? Carrot. It doesn't smell like carrot. <laughs> <laughs> the Frankie shop, so thoughtful. And because I was about? watching her <laughs> beauty tutorial, you guys should all go check it out. And I was learning lots about skin prep. Yeah. And she uses the. Nice Dude, I'm not even through it. It's still on like my tabs on my computer. I'm, I've got to the part where you're talking about like if you, you don't need primer, if you're skin prepping, that's where I'm at. Um, Ella Lou's beauty oil. I'm so excited to prep my skin with it it's the best. and like put it under my eyes. So I'm like, I just have yes. the camera on you. But like, look how fabulous she looks. Just little errands fit. Bye. Yes. Love it. Thank you again. Listening to some Jack Johnson. Taking my supplements for the day. All right, guys. Here is the fit of the day. I'm about to add my aloe jacket. Kelly wearing hers made me realize that I haven't worn mine in a while, and it's super warm. This is the new Skims Outdoor Set. I absolutely love it. I It fits so well, medium in both top and bottom. This is just so cute, perfect to just layer under a jacket. Just put on that Ella Luz beauty oil. I feel very glowy. Um, and a little Summer Fridays lip balm. My little platform Uggs that are sold out everywhere. As soon as they're not, I will link them for you guys. So follow me on Instagram, at Danielle Carolyn, for those updates. I'm about to head to get my hair done. I'm going to my girl Mad's hair. We, I'm not going lighter on the top. I'm still gonna keep the dark roots, I think. Um, but we're just bumping up my extensions and doing more face frames because those like obviously grow out. I just do like a couple, they call them money pieces in the front. Um, See, so yeah, I'm kind of in a rush. Let's go. Here is the final look. It's not put together at all, but <laughs> we're just trying to stay warm. Woo! Just got back, my hair looks great. Like I said, we just lightened up the front pieces um, and then she bumped up my extensions. I love it, I love the way they blew out my hair. I realized I didn't use my Skinny Confidential Ice Roller this morning. I'm about to hop on about an hour long call. Ooh, this is very cold. It feels definitely different than the Amazon one. The Amazon one has its own greatness to it. I'm making some hot tea as well. Wow. This is definitely, I think, better for lymphatic drainage. The other one, you kind of have to like press on your skin, but that one still feels good. This one, I can tell it just really gets in there, you know? Wow, I'm up. <laughs> still loving this Smeg kettle. It's just made, I don't know, I've been craving hot tea a lot more. So I'm just having some chamomile. So we've got a busy day. I have to stay grounded and Zen, so hot tea does that for me. I'm about to take a ginger shot of I mean, I'm such an average person. Like, 
Liquid IV will be consumed right after my call before the shoot. We are just getting down to business. I will talk to you guys after my call. Packing up a bag to go to the Bowery Hotel. Brooke's already in makeup right now. When I get there, they should be finishing up and I'll do my makeup. Kat's doing her makeup, she's awesome. I'm like, it's like a pink duffel. I've got Polaroids, threw in um, rosé. We've got the merch that you guys will see very soon, but I'm so excited about this shoot. Knock, knock. Hello. Hello. Oh my God, this is so cute. What did we get again? Prince uh, Street? Regular. Oh, they're brown boxes. Is that okay? That's fine. Okay. It goes good in here. We were like trying to think about what to take pictures. No, this looks good. It says pizza. That's good. That's good. The amazing photographer is here. It's Maddie. Look at that flash camera. We are ready to go. This is going to be so fun. We just finished makeup. Woo woo! Sneak peek of the merch. So exciting. We have to show you guys the back. Here's the back. I'll show you guys more detail later. But. Exciting! We just got room service espresso martinis, three beans. We love that. Got the pizza, about to shoot. Very excited. guys so it's a little bit later I just I didn't just I got back from the shoot um, and it was so much fun I cannot wait for you guys to see these photos I'm so this is I mean we always say this but I think we always just one up our shoot like our merch like I love this it's so fun we have stuff all over it says like overthinking pizza Empire State Building or there's like a building not Empire State Building it says Gals on the Go podcast, there's a phone. It's just a good time and obviously G Heart TG and we just were needing a zip up and we also wanted to give you guys another co color option. So we did this like dusty rose pink color. They're so comfy, they're so fun. I feel like they're unlike anything we've ever done before. So like there's a martini glass on here. So it's just fun. So I'm wearing a large in both the jackets, Brooke wore an XL just for reference and then I am so excited. We're finally doing GOTG trucker hats. Obsessed. Like, it was just much needed. Everyone needs a GOTG trucker hat in their life. And I'm just going to be wearing this all summer long and starting, like, now, obviously. And then the last item we're coming out with is another tote bag. Because you guys wanted a tote bag that said gal on the go. And we heard you. So, we did it. We did a pink one to make it a little bit more fun and girly. Gal on the go, it's so perfect. It's a nice little pop to any outfit and it was just so fun shooting today and I'm so thankful for this team we've created and just everyone's help. It's weird though, like we got our makeup done and I got my hair done today. Obviously I'm like, I need to like go out on the town but it's a Tuesday night. So Ryan did come over because sweet, a sweet brand called Hanny sent me, they, have, they do razors and stuff. Um, I'm excited to try their razor. They sent me Ruby Rosa pizza which was so nice. We ordered pizza for the shoot, and then like I got a call saying I had pizza delivery here for me, so I'm getting hungry again. It's almost 10.30 now. Wow, time has flown by. Yeah, that's that. I am nervous. Tomorrow's my workout, and I'm just nervous, and I'm trying not to think about it. I'm thinking about it. But I'm just gonna be honest when I walk in there. I'm working out with Jane Simmons. Um, I found her because of Katie Bilotti. She only says amazing things about Jane. We FaceTimed, I told her how, what I've been going through recently and dealing with, with my anxiety and panic attacks and how nervous I have been to work out. And she's been so supportive and she was like, I'm there every step of the way, we'll go slow. So I know, so I feel better knowing that, but it's just scary, you know? Um, so tomorrow morning at 11.30 we're doing it. So I was like, that's also why I didn't sleep at the hotel. Like Brooke and I were gonna like maybe do something, but I was like, you have the hotel to yourself if you want. 
Um, I just need to like wake up in my own bed and like have a proper breakfast and just hype myself up for this workout. So uh, I'm just feeling a little uh, about it, but I feel like once I work out, I will feel better. And once I get just in a rhythm of working out in general, I'll feel really amazing. So yeah, so I'm just gonna clean my apartment's mess. Tomorrow, after I work out, I don't really have anything planned. I just have like a ton of emails to respond to. So I'm gonna do that and just clean. So yeah, today was such a fun day. It's one of those days where I'm just so grateful that I have a platform like this and that so many of you listen to Gals on the Go and I'm just so thankful. So I love you guys. I guess I'll take the makeup off now and I'll see you guys in the morning. guys the time has come I've spent the whole morning I literally meditated this morning you guys I meditated listened to my frequency music now I'm listening to some hype music put on a workout outfit who is she I'm getting excited my nervousness is turning to excitement whenever I get nervous I really try to be like okay how can I change this into like butterflies and I'm, I'm so excited I'm about to get on stage like I did theater when I was younger and I try to like mimic that feeling instead uh, so we're gonna get a move on we're gonna go work out with Jane I'll update you guys after but I'm feeling good I'm hydrated I ate she believes she could so she did she believed she could so she did I don't know why I'm about to cry but I got this I'll see you guys after <laughs> left the gift store. I bought myself a little candles <laughs> to reward myself. But that just went so well. I'm so proud of myself. I feel empowered. I felt strong. She really hyped me up. I walk in and they're playing Drake. I was like, did you guys know I was coming? It was just such a great environment in there too. And Lexi Lombard trains with her too. And I walked in and she was with her. So it was just like a nice warm welcome. And she just taught me how to like truly inhale and exhale at the proper times when I'm working out to help kind of calm my nerves. And obviously it's just good for your workout. So yeah, I feel better. I don't feel like 100%, but I am just so happy. And on Friday, it's going to be me and Katie Bilotti working out with her. So I'm going to start doing this twice a week with her. And I just, I just can't wait to take you guys along this journey. Just came across Drake's store, October's very own. It just feels right. I went to Goop. Now I need to go to OVO, baby. I got the This Smells Like My Vagina candle. And I went, I didn't go in to buy it. I went in to smell it. So I was like, let's see what it smells like. And let me tell you guys, this stuff smells incredible. It's like a rosy scent. It's like a like a fancy boutique would be burning this scent so going to Paltrow good for you <laughs> this is what it smells like this is nice lunch today I have some leftover rice and beans and broccoli just got our photos for gals on the go so I'm gonna go through them and favorite the ones and then she's gonna edit but oh my gosh these are so sick currently taking a little care of quiz to see what supplements they recommend for me this is not sponsored but I am just very interested all right, here are my quiz results. Oh my gosh, so I already take ashwagandha. <laughs> you told us you drink alcohol often. Magnesium I do take. Ooh, I should take, okay, this looks like pretty good. Milk thistle. <laughs> okay, I just said that because I drink on the weekends. I don't really drink on the weekdays at all, but great, this is good. Okay, just ordered my care of, and guys, we just got the film photos back. <gasps> These are so sick. They got developed so fast. We did like some elevator shots. I love this. So fun, oh my gosh. 
So my purest scent diffuser, which is over there, is low on fragrance and I can tell. So I'm going to replace this right now. It's really cool, I can control it. Or I guess I could have it pump out, I call it Hotel Danielle. I can have it pump out some Capri Blue. Mm, that's more summery for me. I'm gonna do another one of these. Here is my little outfit. I still haven't showered after my workout. After I do all of my cleaning that I'm about to do, then I'll shower and like take the shower, you know? I'm wearing this hoodie that Spotify actually sent me, Spotify wrapped. Really cool, it's a mad happy hoodie too. And then I just throw on my slippers, but I just have little pockets of corners in my apartment that have stuff. Haven't unpacked from Florida yet and then just piled on stuff there after the shoot. Have all these boxes that might stay there. Those are organizational things. Have to bring these two things down to my storage unit. And then I have another little corner over here. I've been hiding things. <laughs> More sweatshirts. Storing sweatshirts and sweatsuits and all that in my robe. It's very hard. There's not really anywhere to put it all. So just gonna do lots of cleaning and tidying and putting things away. Um, because tomorrow night, my best friend Caitlin is flying up for the weekend to stay with me. And I'm so excited to obviously whenever I have a guest coming, I want to like make sure everything's clean and everything. I'm so excited to see her. She's like my best friend from high school and we've stayed friends obviously, but yeah. I feel like I should start here because this is the most obvious clutter. Um, so wish me luck. Yay, luggage is unpacked. These are my sweatshirts and stuff. I was able to put a lot in the drawer over there. These are the leftovers. Usually I like pile them in here and that just might have to be. It's just annoying because obviously this is where I put all of my dresses and it, it hits them, but I just am running out of space. So I think this is what's gonna have to happen. Can we fit all of that in here? We will find out. Guys, I did it. She believed she could, so she did. It's all in there. I hung one set up right there. Love that. And then typically what I do, this tote bag is just, I just have totes everywhere. Okay, we're gonna let that one go. But I typically just hang this robe up on there. Ugh, there we go. Cause I pretty much wear it every day. I know my hair looks really good. Woo! Gotta bring my suitcase down and some of this stuff, which is exciting. Maybe put some of these shoes away. They should be dry now from the snow. Things are looking better in here. Oh, this feels so good. Just cleaned up the kitchen a little bit, tidied up <laughs> my desk. Yay, just thought I'd update you guys. <laughs> For now, these shoes are gonna stay here too. All right, we're about to make a little trip over to FedEx um, because I got more Georgia merch in the mail that I bought when we won the national championship. So I got this shirt for my dad, and I thought it'd be a fun surprise. He doesn't know it's coming. And then also for my pops, my grandpa, I got him this national champions shirt. He specifically requested one. So yeah, I'm gonna go ship this out to them, and I also need to go return my Fashion Pass order so I can get more clothes in the mail. Love that. But yeah, my apartment's all clean, I'm so happy. So yeah, we're gonna go for a little walk and then I'll come back and I'll actually shower. That'll, and then maybe juice if I have time. Well, that was easy enough. I always dread shipping things, but it's just, then you leave and you're like, I did that. Gonna head to the grocery store and buy a couple fresh groceries, some just more, I just am constantly buying groceries and some flowers. It's a, it's a get yourself some flowers day, guys. <laughs> maybe some wine. All right, we're back. It was a nice little fresh air moment. I've been in my apartment all day since this morning. Um, I was able to fit everything in my little tote bag. Got myself a bottle of wine. Um, not just to, I don't think I'm gonna drink it tonight, but I love the Josh brand. This is Sauvignon Blanc. I got it in case like, I don't know, Caitlin and I are getting ready for dinner and we want wine, you know, that kind of vibe. 
I got myself some yellow roses. I'm in my yellow mood again because Kelly got me that yellow candle and my yellow hydro flask. I'm just like craving spring, even though um, today is Groundhog Day and the groundhog saw his shadow, which means six more weeks of winter. Um, I also got, I just like don't really have snacks here. So I got some pita chips and hummus. I feel like that's good to have. I love cantaloupe. A lot of people don't like melon. They prefer back berries, but I don't know. This, no, this is a work of art. I was so excited. I used to eat these as a child all the time. These are cuties. They're dairy free. That's not why I got them. I just grew up eating them and they had them there. And then um, I'm trying to like try every single ginger shot I ever see, different brands. So I'm trying this ginger rescue, or it's from the brand, the ginger people. And it's a ginger rescue ginger shot. And then I'm also starting a new segment on just like my Instagram stories because I feel like I am always drinking like three different beverages at once. Um, not that I'm the only one that does that, but I, you guys even notice in my videos, like you're always commenting on your beverages. And I feel like, I don't know, I wanna just start doing something called beverage of the week. So they were selling this a la carte by the, um, whatever, the checkout. And I love grape flavor as we know. And I love Olipop, so I wanna try their great flavor. And I think that's it. And that's all she wrote. It's a lot later now. I got a lot of work done on my computer. I'm in my robe. I'm gonna make some ginger shots for the week. I just got this thing off of Amazon. I just put them in here. It makes like four or five shots. And here's my juicer. I love her. I'm so happy that I have her. Um, so I have a ton of ginger that I've bought. I just do ginger and lemon and then I add cayenne pepper to each shot. Um, still kind of figuring out what I like best. But yeah, I'm just gonna juice a few until I think I can fill this up. I don't wanna do any more than I can store. Ta-da! Yay. Good morning, everybody. It's 8.30 a.m. Got my support water bottle. Or not support, emotional support water bottle. I used to use this all the time in college and for spinning stuff and I filled it up yesterday to go work out and forgot how much I love drinking out of a hydro flask. Um, my legs are so sore. Usually I don't get sore until two days after work. <laughs> my legs hurt so bad. <laughs> that just means I worked hard yesterday. Um, it's a gloomy day here. I woke up in such a great mood. That cloud over my head in the beginning of this week is finally piecing out. Um, I'm hungry. I need to make some brekkie. Probably just gonna do like an eggs and toast moment as I do. Jack Johnson. Not just in the morning, but just all the time. Uh, it's another one of those things that I did in high school. And I don't know, when I listen to Jack Johnson, it makes me think I'm in the car drinking my coffee on the way to high school. I was one of those weirdos that like loved high school. Oh, I did the, oh my God, I didn't even mean to. I put the, okay, I guess I have to match that. The smaller side on the inside. Did not mean to do that necessarily. Guys, last night, I only have a little bit more left of my book, November 9th by Colleen Hoover. And I love Colleen Hoover books. And I'm finally to a point where it's actually good. Like the first 70% of the book, I was like, okay, this is cute, but it's giving me nothing. But oh my gosh, am I so happy I kept re reading. There is a twist and it's getting really good. Like Ryan came over last night for a little bit and I was like, hold on gotta finish this page um so yeah it's always fun when you actually really enjoy a book i have so many recommendations that so many people have gave me 
for my next book and I just don't know what direction I want to go so I'll keep you guys posted probably but I also the new Colleen Hoover book apparently is really good reminders of him but I'm like should I switch it up I also heard the light we lost is really good I don't know but I'm gonna make breakfast and then um, I think I'm gonna end this vlog now because I want to make sure I can get this video up for you guys this weekend because normally I have my video scheduled where it's like my weekend vlog from last weekend will be going up today but Ryan's family was in town last weekend if you guys watched my Instagram stories you saw like went to the med and it was the snow day everything like that but I just like didn't really want to throw the camera in their face they they support me and everything but I was like eh, I don't know if that's the vibe so I don't have a video for today so that's why I'm like ending my week in my life a little bit early so hope you guys can understand um because today's Thursday morning technically but like you still get the vibes you know I love you guys so much thank you so much for constantly supporting me and following me along and just leaving the sweetest comments I just get so excited to post videos every Wednesday and Sunday and I hope you guys enjoy them too subscribe if you guys are new here follow me on Instagram follow me on TikTok for even more content I post on TikTok almost every day um, and stories all the time if you want more Danny Maybe you don't, but I love you guys and I'll see you guys very soon this Wednesday for my next video. Bye.